Amber, welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry I'm screaming. Like I said, it's because I'm literally on um, on a street, so it's kind of loud. But anyways, you guys just saw me go thrift shopping the other day, and I've done all sorts of thrift shopping makeovers before. So today, I'm gonna show you how to turn thrift store finds into high fashion couture. It's easy, it's fun, and best of all, my favorite, cheap. <laughs> so here we go. XOXO Gossip Amber. Okay, so as always, before we get going, here's my outfit of the day. I know my room is a mess, just don't look at it. <laughs> but my outfit's cute, so here we go. We got a cute little sweater with a black shirt underneath. I just watched a YouTube tutorial on how to tie a tie, so I'm like really proud of this. Cute little skirt I actually got on Poshmark. It's BCBG, but I only paid $15. Oh, like goodbye, this is adorable. We look like we're in Gossip Girl. Okay, anyways, <laughs> here we go. All right, so we are outside literally like on um, on the street, so I don't know if this is gonna be too loud or not, but we're gonna see um, what kind of cool stuff we can get to give a little makeover. Bum bum, this is so cute. All right, here we go. Let's see what they got. Ooh, all right, here we go. Let's see what kind of fun stuff do they got today? <clears throat> I look insane. Look at this, only $8.99. This is Saks Fifth Avenue. Hello, work. Okay, so we're looking for nice fabrics and things, like something kind of like what I'm already wearing. This could maybe vibe. Meh. Oh, like something like this, like a dress. Literally, basically identical to what I'm already wearing. <laughs> Perfect. Yes, two finds already in the first 30 seconds. I love this place. Okay, what else can we get? Hmm. All right, so we're also looking for cool fabrics, cool colors, basically whatever catches your eye to make you look expensive. Oh, like faux fur is always good. Look at this, this is only 19 bucks. Hello. Tweed is a great fabric for high fashion. This would actually probably be good, but I don't know, maybe, maybe, maybe. <laughs> oh, like this, a matching set? Let's do it. Oh, now I'm super into ties, but honestly, brand new ties are like $6 on Amazon anyway, so. Oh, I guess I could do a pair of shoes, just for fun. Hmm, maybe, maybe? I don't usually do pants, just because I don't like them. Clearly. <laughs> but all right, let's see, what else? The men's section has some of the best stuff. I always shop in the men's section. I've done a million videos on that, but that's where like also a bunch of my clothes are from. Men's wear. Look at this Dolce & Gabbana, Prada, yes. Like honestly, even just look at that. That's kind of chic. Yachting chic, mm-hmm. I am finding so much good stuff today. This video is gonna bang. Okay, um, oh, this is actually super cool. Look at that. Hmm. All righty, we got some good stuff. Now we're gonna go home and uh, put my little magic touch on it. Oh my gosh, are you so excited to see what we got? Yeah, okay. All right, so I got this black furry coat thing, this coat jacket, which came with the matching dress, iconic. And I got this white sweater dress, and also just for fun. Just thought this was a very beautiful book, so I got this book too. Hi, baby. You're stepping all over mommy's stuff. Excuse me. Here. <laughs> so that's what we got. And uh, let's see what we're gonna do. P.S. Random side note. I just got this in the mail five seconds ago. Let's open this. I got this on Etsy. I just thought this was the funniest thing I've ever seen. This is like from the 80s. <laughs> so fun. So the makeovers. Um, we're gonna go ahead and start with this outfit. Um, this is a good before shot of it. Okay, so you can see the dress. Obviously it's just huge and kind of wonky. Um, something super easy is you could literally just like make it into a little mini dress, which would be cute. It's like Superman. This is why it takes me so long to do my videos. <laughs> you can see the dress laid out flat here. So what we're gonna do first is I'm actually gonna go ahead and cut it in half, uh, which you can see then ends up looking like this. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and tailor that to make it fit me. I'm no expert sewing person at all. Um, I like taught myself how to use this via YouTube tutorials and I'm not very good at it. So excuse the wonkiness, but turned it into a little crop top set, which quite frankly, you could really wear it like this too, but 
we're gonna go ahead and make the jacket. Now the jacket, I'm just gonna go ahead and take the other black vest that I got. I'm gonna go ahead and cut that up and basically I'm gonna trim it with fur. Super easy, Um, you could actually just buy fur trim instead of chopping something up. That would be a lot easier because as it turns out, this makes a ginormous mess. <laughs> Oops. But regardless, um, this is a good way to repurpose something old. So I'm just gonna hot glue that right on. I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the cuffs. I'm gonna put it on the lapel. And I think I'm even gonna put it on the bottom too. But literally, I'm just gonna hot glue that, da -da, da -da, stick that on. Super easy. Um, yes, I do this with things all the time and it doesn't fall off. I don't know, not professional, but hey, sue me. You can see when that's all done, um, it's actually gonna kind of look like this. So simple, this only took me like an hour. Are you ready? Da -da -da -da. Transformation number one. Like work? Oh my gosh, how fun! Oh, it's like Cruella de Vil, but blue. <laughs> like I said, obviously I can't sew um, particularly good, so the seams are all off and everything's a little wonky, but the general idea is fucking fashion. Like, goodbye, hello. This is very Fran Drescher. Or very Amber Scholl. <laughs> so cute! good DIY we showed good before. Voila, voila, voila. Do, do, do. This is actually low key cute, um, but we're gonna cut it up anyway. So, here we go. Let's cut it up. <laughs> Okay, so for outfit number two, we're gonna go ahead and take this little dress and I'm gonna do something very similar. Now this one, you don't need any skills at all. You just need a pair of scissors, literally snip, snip, bada bing, bada boom, look at that. <gasps> a cute little crop top outfit, so fun. Um, Gorgeous, great, nailed it, cute. So for this, I'm just gonna go ahead and fold this over to make it look a little more professional, kind of double roll it. And then I'm just gonna stitch that together so it, um, you know, stays. So just a couple of hand stitching um, stitches right there to keep it in place. And voila, look at that. You got a whole little crop set. You don't even need to know how to sew at all for this. So easy. Honestly, you could kind of be done then, but we're gonna go ahead and give it some uh, fancy trimmings. I wanna turn it more into like a winter wonderland kind of fiesta, sort of inspired by this Kardashian photo that haunts my daydreams all the time. I just love this photo. So um, I'm gonna take this little old shawl that I had. Um, and again, easier to just buy fur trim, but since I have this, whatever, I'm gonna trim this up. So this makes a giant mess too, okay. So you can see I just trimmed those, stitched them together to make them into little cuffs. Did one for the neck as well. Like a fashion forward clown. Snow bunny chic. And fun fact, if you get it as a headband, it's gonna be elastic and uh, you can actually use that around your waist too to kind of trim the top if you want. So look at that. <laughs> That's what I call creative. So we're also gonna make some shoes to match again. Um, I had these shoes in my house and I'm gonna go ahead and put the cuffs again on the base of them to turn them into boots. Like see how cool, instead of just regular ankle boots, boom, now they're furry winter boots. Make them season to season pretty cool. I'll show the completed outfit in a minute, but FYI, here's a couple of other fun, easy, no-so hacks to turn any thrifted look into something new and fabulous. By the way, this concept also works for lots of other things, like if you thrift a giant big uh, men's blazer, which I often do. I actually got this at Walmart, but you know, same thing. So you got this, check it out. Adding something simple like a corset over it can literally turn it into a haute couture dress. Look at that, so runway. God, I love a sexy spy look. Like I said, you've seen me do all sorts of thrifting hacks before, but literally something as simple as changing the buttons, tying up a shirt, or just even restyling something is gonna give it an entirely new look. So this also goes for shoes too. Take a normal pair of shoes, add some little feathers on them or some clips or something, and look at that, super spicy. You know, it's actually so easy to redo things. You just gotta get a little creative. Another huge hack, by the way, you guys, is just to go to the tailor. I do this all the time with clothes I bought on eBay. I've done videos about this a zillion times, but literally even something just as simple as hemming an oversized dress is gonna totally change the look entirely of any set. And then you have your own very unique look, all for the price of less than what you'd pay in a store for a new one. Anyways, back to my little outfit that I just made. Here is what it looks like on the ground, and uh, we're gonna hop over to my new house to do the reveal. Dun -da -da -da. Drum roll, please. Are you ready for the runway? Woo! Dun, dun, dun. Oh my god. Hello. I know it's really dark in here. I'm sorry. I didn't really think this through that it's nighttime. But ta-da! How cute and fun. You can see. Look at that. Add the earmuffs. Add all the cuffs. We are fashion. 
We're ready to go skiing, except not really because we'll die of frostbite. Oh, it gets cold sometimes, I learned that in Paris. The earmuffs are honestly making me a little sweaty, not gonna lie, but you can see, look how cute. We are all high fashion snow bunny, you know, you know. Ooh, look at that, we got a nice fluffy booty. It's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. As I always say, we nailed it. All right, time to go home. So anyways, there you go. That's how you turn thrift store stuff um, into high fashion. As always, like, comment, subscribe for more. I will see you guys very soon for some more broke bitch tips and some more fun, uh, fun shenanigans. Love you so, so, so very much. And don't forget, when life gives you lemons, make them fabulous. Kisses till next time. People always ask if I'm afraid of buying something that might like have spirits in it. Um, I tell you what, this is something I will not be buying.